Installing and using the Kinevo BTC450, a Bluetooth hands-free car kit. Hi, I'm Aaron from Kinevo. Today I'll introduce you to the Kinevo BTC450, show you how to set it up, and also introduce you to some of its features. The Kinevo BTC450 is a Bluetooth car kit which streams music from smartphones, tablets, and other Bluetooth-capable devices. The BTC450 is also a simple hands-free solution for placing and answering calls while on the go. There's a quick setup guide here on the back of the box just to get you started, but let's open it up and take a deeper look. Inside the package, you will find the BTC450 control center, which is attached to the DC power adapter to connect to your car's 12-volt accessory port. Also, we have the 3.5 millimeter audio cable to connect into the auxiliary port. We have an extension 3.5 millimeter uh, audio cable, just in case you need a little extra reach. Two adhesive discs to attach the BTC450 to your vehicle. And inside here, you'll find the user manual. Using these simple controls on the BTC450 control center, you can jump to the next song or go to the previous one. And this is the multifunction button, which you use to play and pause music. More on these later as we install the BTC450 into a car. Now let's install the BTC450 in this car. The car should have an audio system, which has a 3.5 millimeter auxiliary audio input, also known as the headphone jack, as well as a 12 volt accessory power port, also known as the cigarette lighter adapter. Now you can see that the cable attached to the BTC450 is long enough to fit in a variety of vehicles and accommodate a variety of different configurations. The best position to install the BTC450 will be in a location that is closer to the driver and at a height where you can easily take one hand off of the steering wheel to operate the functions of the BTC450. While choosing a spot for the BTC450, just be sure that the cable that reaches the 12 volt power adapter as well as the cable that reaches the 3.5 millimeter input both easily reach and don't strain on the cable. Before installing the BTC450, you want to take a soft cloth like this and go ahead and wipe the spot where you're going to install it as well as on the back of the actual BTC450 disc. Once that has been clean and you've verified that your cables reach uh, the locations, go ahead and peel one side off of the included adhesive disc and attach it to the BTC450. Once that's been done, Go ahead and peel the other side of the disc off and mount it in your car. Now when doing so, make sure that the location of the buttons as well as the cable are where you want them. Your BTC450 will automatically start up when your vehicle is powered on. The blinking blue light here indicates that the Kinevo BTC450 is powered on. The first time you power on the BTC450, it will go automatically into pairing mode, which you'll see by the red and blue lights flashing here. If you do need to enter pairing mode manually, simply press and hold the multifunction button here for approximately four to five seconds, and you'll see the red and blue lights flash. Now let's go ahead and pair the BTC450 with a Bluetooth device. BTC450 can be paired with many devices that are Bluetooth capable, such as smartphones and tablets, many Apple products such as the iPad, the iPhone, and the iPod Touch, as well as Android tablets such as the Kindle Fire HD. Today I'm using an iPhone 5. So we want to make sure we're in pairing mode, and then we go into the Bluetooth settings on our device and scan for BTC450. I have it listed here, so I'm going ahead and click on it to pair it. And now the BTC450 has successfully paired and is now connected to the iPhone 5. Once the initial setup is complete, the BTC450, when switched on, will automatically connect back to the last device it was connected to. And now, let's listen to some music. Since I've already paired and connected the BTC450 with my phone, I can go ahead and just push play right on my device here and the music will automatically start playing. Using the BTC450 controls, if I push the multifunction button, I can pause music and then to resume playing your music. Now to rewind a song, you press the skip back button here or press the skip forward button here. Now let's see how hands-free calling works. Oh, I have an incoming call. I'm gonna go ahead and answer that by pressing the multifunction button. Hello. Hey, how are we talking? Right, it's going great. Are we uh, still on for tonight? Yeah, let's uh, meet up a little bit later and we'll get a game. Okay, sounds good. I will see you then. All right, bye. All right, bye. And to hang up the call, I just press the multifunction button once more. 
Now, if you press and hold the multifunction button uh, down for about three seconds, you'll activate Siri. How's the weather today in Seattle? Here's the forecast for Seattle for today. The BTC450 comes with a built-in USB port so that you can charge and power your accessories while you're on the go. To learn more, search for BTC450 on www.kinevo.com. If you have any questions, send us an email at support at Thanks for watching.